somebody I feel like that like people would recognize you're like on a lot of stuff but you also aren't like in this I'm sure like you know I think people the are one percent yeah, yes right, I'm right. not I'm not I'm lucky I'm in the ten percent which is amazing but I'm not in the one percent and the this strike isn't about the one percent they're okay and they're supporting us because they understand this strike really is about this group of actors that has worked for 20 30 years and about the actors who are starting out now I feel so bad for an actor starting out now to be able to break in and sustain and make a living it's really hard and the streaming companies are making a hit ton of money and it's just time it all has to kind of come together and change Guess what? Barbie and Oppenheimer just made a fortune because people want to go to the movies. Movies, and right now this week, producers would be, studios would be green lighting a million movies because they'd be like, oh, we need the next Barbie or the next Oppenheimer. And they can't do that right now because they can't do anything without us and without the writers. So I feel like that kind of box office stuff is gonna help us. It's like, okay, there you go. Yeah. This is this is why we're here. We're the, the these huge box here. office uh, profits. Um, a lot of the actors maybe worked a day, maybe two days on it. Perhaps they got overtime, you know? And then that's all they'll see from it. And the movie is at the theaters and then it'll go on to streaming and on and on and they'll keep getting profits and we're about actors ago. I was in that. <laughs> The one movie that starts with the B that's very pink had about a thousand sixty five other actors in it and other employees that probably aren't getting paid anywhere close to what the AMPTP members are for making that yeah. large blockbuster. So, it is black and white. yeah, in the It's not necessarily, look, we're realistic. We know that we don't deserve CEO pay, We're not gonna get $22 but, million. But the, the reality of the situation is when you are a working actor, we consider ourselves labor. And yeah. that's how we are looked at by the CEOs. And our wh whether we choose to be actors or whether we choose to be UPS drivers or whether whatever industry we go into, there's a lot of strikes and pending strikes happening right now because I feel like we've gotten farther and farther away from the laborers the supporting the middle class the who middle are class is getting squelched right who are supporting the companies making a lot of money and we used to make a share of it we're not fighting out here because we want you know teslas we're fighting because we can't even afford to to get to twenty six thousand seven hundred and forty dollars to qualify for yeah our only 86 percent of us make right. it yeah I, i've we been here a long those time residuals. i've watched my income drop to a fifth of what it was for doing three times as much work yeah Wow, that's an interesting like yeah, number. Yeah, that's my personal yeah. you know yes. experience, but and it's not because I'm not working because I am. It's because <laughs> what you get paid is so much less.